Hey everyone, welcome back to this brand new video uploading here on the channel of Game Time Life. And in this new video, I am going to be showing you how to get the white color duffel bag off the latest patch of 1.40. Uh, 1.50 so this glitch is super super easy to do and using this method you will get it 100% sure I found this out um, a friend basically sent me the video the original method is by Adam Hernandez if I say that correctly I will link him down in the description box down below he is the 100% founder of it it's his own method and it worked perfectly fine for me when I first tried it out so I'm going to show you guys how to do it, so let's get straight started. So first of all, you want to start off in story mode and basically inside of director mode, you want to shortlist your online character and your bird as always. Then you want to make your way over to an invite only session and you just want to buy this red racing suit that I'm wearing right here on screen. And you just want to save it anywhere in the save your outfits list. Now as soon as you've got that saved, then you're just going to apply a standard outfit. And then you're going to put on the Israel shoot back on this outfit. You do not have to save the standard outfit, just leave it on with the parachute. So then you're just going to start up the parachute mission called A Rich Too Far. Just load it up by yourself and as soon as you got it all loaded up, uh, you just want to hit ready to play and as soon as you can jump out of the helicopter, you just want to open up the parachute and fly through the first checkpoints. And as soon as you've done that, you can just pull up the phone and simply quit the job. Now you will spawn back in uh, like this with the parachute still on your character's back. If you get out of your vehicle and open up your weapon wheel, you should see that you have two parachute backs in of, inside of your weapon wheel. If you have that, then you did it all correctly. So right now you want to set your spawn location over to a last location and you want to fly over to where the time trial is located. So as soon as you've arrived here at the time trial, what you want to do is just fly up high in the sky and then you want to jump from your oppressor or just use any aircraft. And as soon as you basically jump from it, you just want to open up the parachutes and then you want to open up the interaction menu and you want to hover over that racing suit outfit. So as soon as you land safely on the ground and your character is taking off the parachutes, you want to equip the red racing suit outfit just like you see here on screen. Now as soon as you've done that, you just now want to grab yourself any street vehicle which is Nerby the time trial. And then you want to uh, um, drive over to the purple marker to start it up. So as soon as you are here before you start up the time trial, you'll just want to apply any gator mask. So for me... And basically I follow the steps from Adam's video. What you want to do is apply a gator mask. And I think you have to put on the gray neck gator. This one that I'm putting on right here. And this will basically glitch it and make sure that you spawn in with the white duffel bag. So as soon as you have your outfit set up like this, you just want to get back inside of the vehicle. And now you can just start it up. Start up that time trial and just wait for 2 seconds, then you can hold down on the d-pad and just flick over to Franklin and return back to story mode. So as soon as you are back in story mode, you're just gonna load back into director mode and this time we're just gonna be duping the birds again. So just grab a rubber band and just put it around your joystick and your controller so that it keeps flicking between online character and bird. Now what you should notice is that the birds will start duplicating and at the end of duplicating your character will move over to the haystack. This process takes about 25 minutes of your time. So as soon as the birds have finished duping and your character gets on top, then we're now going to be starting to get the white duffel back. So as you can see in the gameplay right here, my character moved over on top. So what you want to do is just let it go for a couple of times until it's fully set on there. And then as soon as you are uh, hovering over the birds that you have shortlisted, you want to press triangle to remove the birds. Then you will be back at the trailer and in your shortlist you should only have your GTA Online character. So now you want to back out, you want to go into actors, go into beach bums and just hover over boardwalker. And now you're just gonna press square to find an outfit with a stick Christmas mask if you want to freeze 
the um, Christmas mask. So I was lucky enough to actually find an outfit with a white duffel bag and a Christmas mask on top. So what you can do is you can do the freeze Christmas mask glitch, which I will link in the description box down below with a little timestamp. Or you can just keep searching until you find a white duffel bag with a Christmas mask. But I think I was very, very lucky because you will not find this very quickly. So as you can see right here, I have it right there. So if you have obtained the um, white duffel bag with a Christmas mask, you are basically ready to bring it online. So as you can see right here, this is the outfit that I've got. It has a gingerbread mask and a white duffel bag. It looks clean. It has no blacklisted items. So we're going to bring this online. So if you have yourself a white duffel bag outfit with a Christmas mask too, frozen Christmas mask whatsoever, then you want to press triangle to shortlist it and right now we're going to test if it's stuck to the armor. So what you're going to do for that is you're just going to go over to the story characters and as you can see when I was going to be doing that, my game basically unglitched and I was back from before. So if that happens to you too and you see the stock characters like Franklin, then you just want to shortlist your bird again, go back into the shortlisted actors. And you just want to flick back between your online character and the bird to get it back on top. And then again, you can just simply delete the bird out of it. And then you want to hover over that outfit that you've just shortlisted with the white duffel bag. So now you can just go back into the story characters and you can hover over Brett. As you can see, when you hover over it, it should take away the armor. And if it also takes away the duffel bag, that means that you cannot transfer it to different outfits. But as you can see for me, it only took away the armor and the duffel bag is still on. So if you have that, your outfit is computable. So then you want to go back into the shortlisted actors and just grab that outfit, including the armor. And then you want to take it inside of director mode. So as soon as you are in director mode, just walk around for like 30 seconds in the game. And then you want to hold down on the D-pad and just switch over to Franklin, Michael, Trevor, whatsoever, and accept the alert. So now if you do not uh, have any problems, you should load into story mode wearing this outfit that you want to bring online. So walk around for another 30 seconds, then you're going to press pause and you just want to go over to an invite only session. Now if everything went correctly, you should either load in with a parachute or with a duffel bag. And for me, this method is very consistent, so I always spawn in with the duffel bag. Um, so if you do load in with a duffel bag, you can just proceed and just go ahead and save it. But if you do load in with the, duff with the parachute, all that you have to do is go to CEO, go to style management and just click once to the left and then back to none. And it should activate your white duffel bag. So right now I'm going to show you quickly how to save the duffel bag inside of your saved outfits. So for that, again, you're just going to grab a Oppressor MK2 or you're just going to grab a aircraft. And you just want to fly over to the mask store. So as soon as you are here at the mask store, if you have an aircraft, make sure that you are flying above the sea. And if you're using an oppressor like me, you just want to fly towards the lands and then you want to jump out of the aircraft and open up the parachute. So now I just want to crash inside of any section from the mask store. And as soon as your character gets up, you want to start spamming right on the D-pad to access any of these sections. And as soon as you've done that, you can now just press square and you can choose a slot where you want to save your outfit on. So I just saved it right here. And as soon as you've done that, you can just back out and you can open up the interaction menu and just reapply the outfit that you've just saved. And now your white duffel bag is all secured and save it inside of your saved outfits list. Now this duffel bag is not bricked so you can change outfits while you are wearing it. But of course you cannot access the closed door so you do have to switch up your outfits if you want to access the closed door or like the emanation. So this was basically the tutorial on how to get this super cool white duffel bag. I also leave a little link in the description box down below. If you want to transfer it over to different outfits it's very very easy to do. So. If it was helpful, please leave a like on this video, subscribe to the channel of Game Time Live for more glitches and outfit tutorials, and turn on post notifications to get informed with the latest videos. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone!